I am here in beautiful Southern California at a place called Extreme Precision. I'm gonna step inside and do a factory tour with a friend of mine named Eric, second generation machine shop owner. And guess what? Extreme Precision, it has to be extreme, right? Kinda like the heat out here in the summertime in California. But let's go inside and have a look. Well, my friends, we made it inside. I got my buddy Eric with me here today, and you are getting a first time only exclusive tour of Extreme Precision or EP, this second generation genius over here. Am I allowed to call you genius, Eric? I love it. All the time. I love it. He'll take yeah, it. I'll Has take started it. this machine shop about 30 years ago. It's around 30 machines, continues to grow here in Southern California, and I got very excited when I showed up here. I was like, Eric, Eric, I know you didn't expect anyone to be here with cameras today, but would you mind letting me show off your shop? And you said? I had no idea what I was getting myself into <laughs> at all. <laughs> well, are you happy we're here at least? I love it. It's been great meeting you for sure, and I get a lot of knowledge from you. Yeah, so it's been really, really fun. Okay. Well, we're not even done yet. We're going to keep going. Well, this part, we're just getting started, aren't we? Yeah, yeah, exactly. Well, so, so yeah. let's take a little walk. I see a lot of yeah. Mori Sikis, yep. uh, DMG Moris we're going to get into yep. a little bit. Yep. Let's talk a little bit about your 30-year history and how you got into manufacturing to begin with. For sure. So my dad was an immigrant from Holland, learned trade school, is over there, moved over here. I grew up in machine shops my whole life, and so I just kind of, well, then my dad opened up a machine shop. By, his, by himself. I started working with him for many, many years, and I just developed, I guess, a, a knowledge for machining. And I just decided that at the end of the day, I was gonna open up my own machine shop. So now I've been doing this on my own for, like you said, almost 30 years now, and it's what I know. Wow. So, yeah, and I really actually enjoy coming in every day. I love the new stuff that comes out. It's fun for me, it's fun for me with the guys. So yeah, it's really nice. It looks like you have a good team. Everybody's really smiling, team. great inventory. Right? But as yeah. I'm looking around, I see yeah. a lot of high precision machines here, Eric. What kind of parts are you making? Where are you focused? I, it looks like a job shop. It looks like yeah. a lot of high mix, low volume. Yeah. I imagine you're always looking to bring in more work, but where are you focused? We are, so um, we have a lot right now, a lot of our work is defense work. Um, and, it, and it kind of flips from aircraft, aerospace, defense. For, you know, that's kind of our three major type of corporations that we do work for right now. Um, we've done others, we've done medical before, but it just happens to be the slot that we fell into right now. Yeah. How is, would you say, business right now? Because I travel the world a lot, as we've yeah. already talked about. Most yeah. of the people watching right now get, no, I get to see a lot of shops. Yeah. And it seems like defense is doing really well. Commercial yeah. aerospace has had its ups and downs, ups and, downs. and that type I would of thing. Agree with you. Yeah. But where do you see it right now? Because again, all of your machines are running, all your employees are smiling, yeah. everyone seems yeah. to be doing well. Yeah. How do yeah. you see it? Um, I see it as I think it's just gonna. I think we're in a little. I think it's pent up, and I think it's ready to kind of blow up. Is okay. What I think, and not blow up in a bad way, but in, in a, a good, good way. way. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. There yeah. are different ways to blow up. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. I think there's a lot of things going out there. I think a lot of companies are still trying to figure out what to do. Um, and yeah, I think I, I, I can see it. I can feel it. Yeah, so I'm excited about it. So I think for us to talk about what we're doing and the new technologies and all that, which I know I need to develop a little bit more, um, that's my goal. Eric, let's be honest, man. Yeah. Everyone who's watching right now, all the shops I've been into, you said I might need to develop a little. We all yeah, do. All we do. all do. If yeah. you take one day off in this industry, yeah. Yeah. somebody has created something You're new. Right. So right. that's not just on, that's on everyone. And that's yeah. why we do these videos. That's yeah. why we show off these shops. Yeah. But the world yeah. needs to know the type of invisible industry that's making everything around us and people like you right. that are second generation and believe right. and have a passion right. and love it. So when we talk about the next steps, maybe what the future holds, for your company, for this extreme precision. I love saying that, by the way. Well, you know, it's what do you really, think the future holds? You know, it's really fun for me, though, too, is I have to say that because not knowing at all anything about you, I have a thing that I don't, I don't know, I don't look people up or anything like that. I can't wait to see some of the stuff that you've already done because we were already talking about new technologies and the things that you've already done, and, and I'm not, I don't watch those kind of things. So that is one thing I'm really excited about. And as far as... Um, developing the business I mean I think I could do I need to do more marketing um, I need to get out there I need to do things like what I'm doing with you which is really because we know that I would say a lot of uh, machine shop people probably aren't the best marketers in the world I would totally agree right? so we need to do a better job on that 
not only that, but on the other side of it with technology and robotics and all those kind of things. You know, someone like myself who yeah. is honored to be here, by yeah. the way, and yeah, the fact I that, that and everyone heard you, I don't know who yeah. you are. Yeah. He doesn't know, that, that's fine, yeah. not everyone yeah. does. I can't wait to look later. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But that's the wonderful yeah. thing about it is, yeah. Eric, you were open to exploring something new. Yeah. And, and I have a passion, you have a passion for an industry that a lot of the world would consider invisible. We have our phones, we have our cars, yeah. we have our clothes, yeah. we have our microphones, yeah. but nobody cares how how it was made for the most part, You're right. and yet it's there. So thank you for opening right. your doors. You're thank right. you for wanting to do those yeah. things. Yeah, of course, yeah. It is really fun sometimes, I since we do aircraft work or we do defense work, and sometimes I don't know what I do. I could, it's always <laughs> a little piece to a puzzle. And sometimes I get, I get the opportunity to go to other manufacturers, or not manufacturers, but people that we do work for, and they show us where that part goes to, like in a, in a and I don't know. And the overall and, scheme and of F, things, right? 35 or something like that. And I'm like, wow, that's cool. And it just makes me want to even do better for them because I know how important it is. Oh, you're yeah, so right. So, and you're yeah. here in Southern California. Yeah. And I would make the discussion that the, the hub or the heart of manufacturing probably sits in the Midwest. But California yeah. is thriving. I mean, despite whatever side of... I don't even know if we want to, we, we're not getting into politics whatsoever, yeah. but whatever yeah, side yeah. we sit on, when right. it comes to that world, manufacturing is booming here in California, right? Yeah, I don't know, it, it always seems like it has, and I don't know if that's because we have, it started off here as some of the big aircraft companies, defense companies, I really don't know why, but they have always been around Southern California, and I hope they stay here, I hope they're not all going to the Midwest, <laughs> but yeah. So. We're not going to lose them, they're going to stay okay, here, good, you're going to, so. Good, yeah. We're, we're starting to come close to the end of this shop. We've yeah. seen a bunch of machines. I want to leave an opportunity for you to kind of, any messages that you have for people watching right now, MTD, even though, as you said, I don't watch a whole lot of this, yeah. there, we have a global audience. We have yeah. people that will reach out for you from, or from around yeah. the world and say, I want to work with Eric. Yeah. I saw the machines, I saw the dedication, I saw the people, yeah. I saw the potential and possibilities. Right. Are there any messages that you would like to share about who you are, what you do, and anything you could bring to their attention? Yeah, I mean, we already went over the website a lot. Um, yeah. Let's do it again, though. It's always yeah. good to reiterate. Okay. Uh, yeah, that's what I hear. Yeah, extremeprecision.net. And uh, yeah, we're here for everybody. Um, we uh, are quality, on time, everything like that is really important to us. And we always like to have an opportunity to show what we could do. And I think that's the only thing I can ask for. So, yeah. I have one final question yeah. for you. It's the most difficult question of the day. Okay even though secretly we already made a video for it. So go back and watch uh, that. Okay, okay. I see a lot of machines here. Yeah. This is a brand new YCM this is right a brand here. Brand new Very YCM. cool, yes. very, very cool. Really so excited, So for everyone, yeah. Eric says, really yeah. excited. For everyone yeah. watching, we made a separate video on this machine. Take yeah. a look to see why Eric invested in this YCM machine. Price point with precision yeah. and partnership, all really great, Eric. Everything really good, yeah. This is wonderful, and it's people like you yeah. that make me want to do my job yeah. every single day, to yeah. showcase what you're doing, to allow yeah. us to come in, to really embrace an opportunity. So thank you for now being what I would consider a friend. Well, thank you too, because it's been a lot of fun for me too. I really appreciate it, honestly. It's been super fun. And and, yeah. and we have a lot of soccer fans here today, but wow, we're, do we're, we ever. We just have to be careful who we... Uh... Well, the MTD is from England, Okay. That's where it's based, but go Holland, right? <laughs> you know, yeah, I have to go Holland, but we have, you know, Colombia, we got Argentini, Argentinians, so yeah, we got a lot of stuff going on. We're here. gonna cheer for everyone? Yes, oh, it, we cheer for good matches. Cheer for good matches. For good All right, matches, my yeah. friends, this is extreme precision. I'm gonna see you again outside. Okay. This is my buddy Eric. This is a machine shop packed with machines here in Southern California, ready to do your precision job shop work. 30 years of experience. This guy is the man. I'll step outside and I'll see you again in just a second. All right. Well, that is Extreme Precision, an exclusive tour of a really cool shop. I hope you guys have enjoyed it as much as I have.